Yo, what's up? I know this has been something that 800,000 million people have talked about and it's so in the news and it's so popular, but bruh, Elon Musk, you need to shut up, dude. I've seen that man make good takes. I've seen that man make bad takes, but what he is super good at is posting the worst fucking memes of all time. I'm not even joking when I say that this man is going complete boomer mode on all of us. And it's like a little different than your aunt or your grandma posting a silly meme about what whatever the fuck on Facebook. Like this is posted on Twitter for his 115 million followers, my guy. Like dog, the owner of this entire <laughs> website is posting the dumbest, the most unprofessional shit of all time. Like no shit, the website's going down, dude. No shit, you're hemorrhaging money. No shit, I don't know. <laughs> the N word has gone up 500% in the past like month or whatever. So, so, such a weird thing to be like seeing, you know, firsthand. In High school in my astronomy class we would literally talk about elon being like one of just the smartest people in the world because that was back when he was completely focused on spacex and space exploration and stuff like that and like everybody was like oh shit this dude is awesome and like yo <laughs> all of my fucking i don't know respect expectations have just fucking gone down the drain and I don't, i'm not gonna recap everything that's happened with twitter in the past like two weeks or whatever because there are 900 channels that are 400 times bigger than mine who have already talked about it like 8 million times. What I really wanted to go over today was the horrible memes that Elon Musk has been posting on Twitter. I say this in the nicest way possible. My guy is the unfunniest human being on earth and that is not only apparent from his tweets but you know his SNL appearance. Something that I'm sure a lot of people are trying to physically remove from their memories because oh that sucked. <laughs> but how about we all just take a little trip over to Elon Musk's Twitter page and just kind of check out what's going on. A big premise for some of these memes is how he is making it so you can get verified on Twitter for $8 a month rather than, you know, becoming a celebrity, working your social status up, whatever, you know? So like anybody, like my mom, if she wanted to, could be verified on Twitter for eight bucks a month. Anyways, Elon Musk memes, you know? He tweeted this three hours ago. Please note that Twitter will do lots of dumb things in months coming, but like, e Twitter's been doing dumb shit ever since it was like conceived, <laughs> especially since you took over. Twitter's been doing dumb stuff and like, yeah, well, yeah, like obviously it's going to continue because bro, you're not doing anything. You're hemorrhaging money. That's what you're doing. Posted this shirt that says your feedback is appreciated. Now pay $8 with a, with a check mark. And that got 657,000 likes. Bro, that is the least funny thing I've ever seen. That is, is that even a joke? Twitter usage is at an all time high, lol. <laughs> and then someone said, it's like the exact inverse of Tesla stuff. <laughs> I know, dude, it's so weird to think about that this is the same guy who invented Tesla. Okay, now we're getting into the iFunny Facebook meme territory. Yep, it's a picture of a soldier with what seems to be messenger pigeons and it says three unread messages. And Elon said, how times have changed back when birds were real. But if Twitter is bird, then that means you're so old, dude. You were too old to be posting this shit. What? How old is Elon? Hang on. Ah, you're 51. <laughs> I guess that it, it does make sense that he's making boomer memes because my guy, that was not funny. None of this is funny <laughs> at all. It like, it hurts to read. Oh my God, dude. Look at this fucking tweet. Was magma before it was cool. This rocks. Ow! 51. <laughs> the owner of this app. Your app is hemorrhaging money and you're posting shit like this? That is going to comp- ah, I, just, I don't get it. What the fuck? Why is small talk even legal? Interesting. Okay, I mean like, okay. Let's continue to some more fucking old ass meme formats. $8 a month for Twitter verification. So much for free speech. You can still use Twitter for free just without the benefits. Yeah. At first, we weren't mad at you because, you know, this is like somewhat taking away free speech. We're mad at you because there are people who are already verified, who are who now have to pay $8 a month. You know, Stephen King said it best. They should, you should be paying him to be on the platform. That man is a legend. And your app is filled with very influential people who should not have to pay this shit. It's like The Rock and Adam from your science class should not be able to <laughs> reap the same benefits from Twitter. That's just how fame works. That's how celebrity status works. It's an interesting concept, I will say, but I think it's much better off on paper. When it's executed in real life, it's just embarrassing. Once again, 
old ass meme format. Oh yeah, I'm so excited. I get to I get to get my $8 Starbucks drink that's gonna last me 30 minutes. No, I don't want this $8 verification that'll last me 30 days. This has 1.8 million views? Holy shit. Again, it's like, yeah, of course you can critique people for spending. No, never mind. Fuck that. People can spend money however the fuck they want, dude. You decided to spend billions of dollars on this app, and clearly that's not working out for you. So who are you to judge? An $8 Starbucks drink is fucking delicious and awesome. You know, <laughs> verification on Twitter is just just going to get you bullied on the internet, get you cyber bullied. And like the benefits that you can reap, like, yeah, they might be cool, but like, if you're just a regular person, then there's really no advantage for you. I feel like this is for people. I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Spoiler alert. You get what you pay for. We weren't paying anything. <laughs> it was much better. I, no, actually, no, Twitter's always sucked. It's a cesspool, but at least we weren't paying for it. Twitter speaks to the inner masochist in all of us. Okay, I'll give him that. To all complainers, please continue complaining, but it'll cost eight bucks. Oh, fucking got him, dude. Good one. <laughs> 51 years old. This dude is so goddamn desperate for money. This He's ruining Twitter, my guy. Oh my God. Oh, God. Well, that's gonna be it. <laughs> Just a funny little look down what the fuck is happening on that app. Uh, if, you, if you made it this far in the video, thank you. I really appreciate it. I hit 30 subs yesterday. Thank you guys so much. That's super crazy. I'm actually already at 33 at, at the time of this recording. Again, can't express how excited I am for this. Uh, be sure to like, comment, and as I said, subscribe, please. I'd really appreciate it. All right, have a good one, guys. See ya.